Well, hey guys, it's Captain Daddy here for day number 13. I just finished watching the video for day number 12, and I am sorry about that video. It is uh, not very entertaining to watch. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to make sh make sure that we have all these. This is copper. I'm going to change you to copper. You can stay cobalt. I want you on cobalt, and I want you on cobalt. You can go aluminum. You can go aluminum. Uh, you aluminum. I want everything on this side aluminum, and then everything on this side copper and cobalt. So that's the first thing we're gonna do today is just kind of get all this organized. So we have two copper and three cobalt, and then one, two, three, four aluminum. So we're just gonna kind of ignore the power situation for now. Let's see. It's middle of the night. Uh, the oil pump is running. That's going to just run as long as it can. Because I don't think we can get this bad boy up anytime soon. I don't think so. Uh, some cobalt. I mean, did any of the cobalt even come out? I should have looked when I was down here. It doesn't look like it. I pretty much stripped all this out at the very end of day number 12. Just trying to piecemeal. So we're going to ignore this mine for a while. And we're going to do a little bit of base work today. Um, I'll grab one of these mountains first. So what I want to do is now that we've kind of... I've got a little bit of a footprint and we've got some stabilization stuff going on. I want to work on expanding out our base here. Specifically this, I'm going to put this guy up under here and take this guy. So this barn is ultimately going to go upstairs and I'm going to put a butcher table. I've decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a butcher table right here. That's where I'm going to go. So I don't have to worry about bringing that. So I'm going to go ahead and place it that way. I don't have to worry about bringing everything. I won't have to bring the uh, butchered the animals that I want to butcher all the way upstairs. It's just iron ingots. I mean, it's really not that bad. And that way, this barn can go upstairs. A little bit of rain coming. So let's go upstairs. I'm gonna show you what, what my plans are for this for this barn. Grab some planks here. I don't know how effective we're gonna be. It's April, so I would like to get some of these base upgrades done. Now that the weather's turning nicer. We could probably go do some lootings to some of those towns that we haven't looted yet. This is the reset. So my plan, I think, as of right now, is the barn is probably going to go up into this area somewhere. So first thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make some sacrificial walls, I think. Like these three. I mean, I could probably get away with not having three walls. But I do want to go up one more level. So I am going to build this out. And it may end up staying like this. Then I think I just want to do another one of these right turn staircases right up against it. Not that direction, not that direction. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, something like that. Okay, let's see where we are here. Hello, rain. Thunderstorm. So if I can get that guy up top there. Hey, they just kind of hang out. And those animals will have a nice, beautiful view of the valley below us. And... They'll be none the wiser. So let's get this built. Then we'll get the barn located up here. Uh oh. It'd help if you could drive. Let's get this located up here. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And then I think we're going to just ultimately going to attach to these guys to something like this. Obviously, these guys need to be moved out of the way. Because they cannot be in the middle like that. Sure, get up there for now. It's beautiful. I love you. Right there. Let's see where we are here. Try to get these all running this relative the same direction. Last three. And I think we're going to need probably at least one more, maybe two more. So let's go to get another refill. Because I do want to put some railings and stuff up there as well. Because I don't need myself falling off. Because I will fall off. I can load you up instead of waiting. I mean, it looks like he's doing plant duty over there right now, which is fine. You gotta get the plants up. Alright, let's see where we are here. Hopefully, we can get away with a 2x2. Two two. Well, I guess this is technically a 3x2. It is technically a 3x2, right? And then we'll get all this attached to. The mountaintops get it all nice and stable. Two more logs. 
You think I can get away with that? I do not think I can get away with that. I think I'm gonna have to have one more. Something like that. Okay. Let's see if we can get away with that. Uh oh. Need some more logs. Get the tech point for the butcher table. And now that we can make a butcher table, don't think it really matters. Alright. So, let's get you out of the way just for now. And let's just see if we can relocate this barn. Mm, I don't like it overhanging like that. There's no reason. It's doing that collision thing, I think, again with the mountaintop. Hmm. Hmm. Thinking, do I want to go? Can I go out? If I go out one more, that would make it even with everything else. That would make it even with the way we've done it. Right? Because everything else is kind of coming up to that point. Okay, so let's just do it that way. We're passing through. Are you on log duty, sir? You're on log stands. That's your number two. You should be, like, all over those logs. You have nothing else to do, really. And they're all close by. I mean, they've, a lot of them have respawned at this point. So get on it. Yeah, you're running around up here like you have no job. Okay. Let's see if we can get... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That, that's much better. That's much better. We can get you in there. Oop, it's crooked, though. Oh, no, it's crooked. Can't do right, it. So let's take a look here. That's straight. You can go right towards that back edge. Something like that in there. Maybe some room for railing. Yeah, we don't need to... We don't need to really smush it up in here. We've got some room, right? So let's see. That'll be fine. We can throw rails there. We can throw some rails here. We have access to it all the way around. Excellent. 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 Okay. All right, Mr. Michael. Oh, yeah. Looking great. Looking great. Some more bite or some more spoiled food. I have a bad habit of calling the food that I'm going to turn into biofuel as already biofuel, but I think you guys understand what I'm saying when I say biofuel. All right. So as far as that, well, we got one, two, three. So there's six of them, so that's good. That's a little bit better. Mike, I'm not sure what's going on with you, but I'm going to need you, bud. Woo! Yeah, that's there. So now this footprint is really, really opened up down here. And ultimately, this whole area, I believe, is going to become part of our... So, give me a minute here, folks. Let me... I don't know what's going on with Mike, why he's not grabbing any of these. If it's an access issue, because he really doesn't have anything on his list. And this is all so close. This will help him collect a lot faster. So he doesn't have to worry about chopping itself. Drop all this, drop all that, drop all this. Alright, so we've got some plank sauce. He's got logs on the ground. He's acting like he can't get in and out or something. I don't know why he's not grabbing that stuff. I, I don't understand. Um, it's very strange to me. Okay, because we're going to go ahead and we're going to expand this guy out. Um, I guess you're slightly in the way. Are you slightly in the way? Let's get this guy expanded out. And I know some of that is in the wall. This railing can go away. Come here, you. Uh, we'll throw a window there for now. That'll look okay for now. Put some logs into you. Something like that. I need more logs. Put some planks into you. All right, Mike, you doing your job yet? Doesn't even look like he's gone step foot out there. The watermelon crates, I'm gonna go ahead and move that all the way back upstairs because this is the animal's primary food source. And I don't, I saw, I've seen that in a couple of video edits and I'm gonna go fix that. I don't know why I had, oh look, we have a baby chicken, plenty of power. Okay, I don't know why this right here is a wall. Close that door. I don't know why you're a wall. That ooh, what are you, this should be a railing to, to really clear that out. Of that. I don't. I don't know why. Now he's grabbing watermelons, bro. I need you on logs, man. Not watermelons. Not one measly watermelon. It's not helping me. You brought me two. All right. So do I pull him off of plants? Because I don't think. I mean, holy moly. We have a decent su supply in there. I'm going to... I am. I am going to pull him off of plant duty for now. I'm going to just make logs number one. Logs one and then plants. 
that way maybe he will get refocused on the, the item that I need because I really want to get this base overhauled a little bit to make it a little bit more functional for us. And I can't do that without his help. So I'm going to go ahead. It's, not, it's a nice wintry, well, not wintry. It's a nice spring day, so I'm not worried about staying. Do I go? Which way do I go with it? Do I go in and make that part of the wall? I mean, I really like doing the thing where like that, the wall coming through like that. I think that's a cool look. These are just planks, I think, on this door. This wall, it's a frame. We give me, whoa, did you see that? Try to see if I can get some more logs. Sticks, don't you know, stinking sticks, man. Let's see, I like this, this corner is so cool to me. Very, very cool looking corner to me. Uh, this guy's gonna, I may end up throwing logs here. Just like this. And that'll give him maybe an opportunity to get caught up on the log thing. All right, come on, come on, Mike. Yeah, running down. Still looks like you're running around up there near the plants. I don't know what your infatuation is with the plants, but that's you, beautiful. I don't think I have any planks, do I? Nope, no more planks on me. We'll go upstairs and grab some. Some planks, some glass on the front of the, the structure, just like the glass into that cave. And he refilled fast. There you go, Mike. That's what that's what I need you to do, bud. Right there. I need you to work at that pace. Oh, look, 6:08 a.m., day number 13. The sun's coming up. Looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. And let's see, filling out all these guys. What do we need? One more log. Get a log. That's right here. All right. And then I think we're going to just throw a window here. Like I said, this is ultimately going to become glass at some point in time. Another log. And since this is internal space, we know we're no longer going to need that support. And we won't use this support here. And this will end up being a door. It will be a wood door for now. But then ultimately, later in life, it will become a nice glass door. Do I have any more planks on me? I do. I need two logs. So let's grab this guy. Head upstairs, and then we're going to see if we can't. Thank you, Mike. Yeah, see, that's the order it should be. I think you should be on logs first, for sure. Because you are rocking and rolling, man. You are a superstar now. Can you grab a few more planks off of us here, on here? Because we are going to have to build some doors. Oh, I'm overweight. The one in there. All right, let's see. What was I working on? Sorry, I was uh, had a meeting. All right, throw some more in here. Just gonna try to get this guy. I mean, whatever, right? I mean, that's ultimately gonna end up becoming something else. Okay, so uh, do I leave this open for now? It is spring, so I'm not overly, overly concerned about it. I mean, mm, what do I do here? I mean, I guess I can place what. Ultimately, it's going to be here. It's just it really blocks the view. But we can kind of get an idea of what this is going to look like. And I think I have to do something crazy with those steps because the steps kind of block it. So if that's the case, I'm going to back that back out. Hold on. Stand by. This will be glass. This railing can go away. Come here. Oh, missed it. It's all right. And this ultimately, and those will ultimately end up being glass as well. So that's kind of the way that's all going to track. And then this is going to be our nice. Look at all these sticks. I have no room. All right, what's going on in my inventory here? Bunch of planks. All right, let's, let's throw a door here because that'll be something that we certainly need. Door. Let's get rid of some of the planks. Okay, cool. Yep, cool. All right, let's see if we can grab some sticks. Throw these maybe like in the fire or something. And we got a bunch of materials here. Wasn't I working on a light that needed glass? No, oh, didn't need glass. All right, what do we got here? This power panel guy. I mean, it's, I guess it's fine the way it is, huh? So that's cool that, that we've spent a little bit of time. Yeah, see? See, those things are building up, so that's good. All right, let's move these things. Uh, what do I want to do here? This, this, this is not good. This is so temporary. This thing has been moved like a million times. This poor fireplace. And brick drying, I mean, whatever, just get out of the way for now. 
see if we get our living room organized here a little bit better. This is going to kind of be our living space. Yeah, we can put you right by the window so the breeze will come in and air out the clothes. The weapons rack, sure, we can put you right here. In and out of the door, it'll be just fine. I like the glass. So glass needs steel and screws, so we're definitely going to go fly through that. All right, let's get you... Um, let's see. There's the grinder. Where do I want these things? I, I, I want them kind of... I might move the storage. Give me just a minute to move the storage. Doesn't fit there. Does fit there. Something like that would be just fine. Medical supplies. Hardware. That's fine, whatever. Gardening. I'd put these in the same order. I'd find them every time much faster, but, you know, big stuff. That's definitely in a different spot. And then just stuff. Whatever, right? All right, so now we've got that. So now we can figure out what we're going to do. I like the idea of... Um, this, is, this is definitely going to be kind of like our living area. So I don't want to move these things too many times. Let's see. Got to empty it before we can move it. All right. And I have no place to put anything because I have so many planks on me. Got myself into a spot here, huh? Throw you in the hardware for now. I got some glass building up. Let me go put these planks back up. If I have room for them up here. I probably still have some, yeah, two on me. Do I have any planks to throw in? Anything is fine. Let's just build like a storage box or something on the ground. And I can throw a couple planks in it and then we'll come back. There we go. Okay, it's empty. Take you all out. Um, I did have another extractor running back here, so let's toss one. Guess I didn't have any iron in that, that stack. No steel, some more copper, no iron, we just proved that. Some aluminum, one cobalt, and some lead. So that is now emptied out. So I think this guy can maybe go onto this wall right here. Uh, which way? Which way do we think is straight? That way it looks the straightest, right? Let's put you on that wall right there. And I still can't interact with you, right? No matter what I do. No matter how I... Man, that is just a, a bummer to me. We'll put these guys hopefully side by side. Saw it for a second, so it will go. I well, saw it for a second, it will go. Hello? I want you to come. Oop, oh, oop. Oh. It's sticking out too far, though. Uh, maybe we'll just bring this one out just to line it up a little bit closer. It's fine. It's off the wall a little bit. Doesn't have to be perfect. Let's see. That's fine. Whatever. And then we'll start putting some of our ingots and stuff kind of like. Oh, that's. It won't let me. For some reason, it does not want me going near that line, that imaginary line. And then I'll. Be I'm sure ultimately these will end up getting moved again. It's fine. Totally fine. At least I can see what we're working with here. We can continue iron frags. You can go back up here. Iron frags. Straight. Basically centered enough. Okay. Uh, this grinder and everything. I'm not sure where this is going to go. This hand mill. You over here. I've got to stop moving this thing. I've moved this thing so many times I'm never going to find it when I need it. Alright. So now this guy's completely empty. We need to take a look at our power because we've been goofing off almost all day and I'm not taking a look at our power situation. Where are we on the power thing here? Is the sun what time is it? 9.38 and the sun is up or fully charged. The oil pump, grinder, all of that should have been running quite a bit, a bit ago, but I have failed to do my duties, so therefore they have not been running. So these all emptied out, these all emptied out. Oh, I got, oh yeah, so stones, 
this stack of stone is going to go over here and to keep you going. That's right, because I'm pretty much not going to... This power panel has got to be moved. Because these stones are pretty much just going to go directly to... Uh, it's fine right there. Okay. Those will get positioned better. Okay. What did you need to get running? Four cobalt and some iron. Did I have any cobalt? Come on, I had one cobalt come out. So let's go take a look, see what we've got coming out of here. Some more aluminum. Oh, this is all going to be aluminum on the side. This is absolutely all aluminum on the side. Copper. I don't really have any need for copper. There's two cobalt. Two more cobalt. Alright, so there's some decent coming out of there, just like that. Let's see, you you are completely empty. You need fuel in you. I don't think I want to smelt any more aluminum. I can smelt some more aluminum, that'll be fine. And then I'm going to start taking all the sand and all, because I do want to start working on the glass. So that'll be fine there. Let's see if we can pop some coal real quick to get those guys filled back up. And then we're going to take a look at our... I'm going to pop this guy right here. Hey, we'll take another iron ore. Sure. I mean, I know I should start making the steel, but I'm not going to. No, I'm not going to take my own advice because we're not really going to work on placing any of that... Is that one right here on this corner? That is one, isn't it? can't tell, and you can't get to it, so that's a waste. But maybe it'll reset. Okay. Let's get out of here. Get these guys burning. So you can have some fuel, just like that. And you can have some fuel, although you are pretty much full. You can hold that aluminum. What's that? Are you full? You're not full. I'm going to smelt you. Put you here. All right. So this log cart is full. I'm gonna bring it upstairs. Gonna put all this stuff on the plank stand. I don't know why Mike hasn't finished. It's like he lost his axe or something. Like, that's all right. Woo! Thank God that's there. All right. So this guy is gonna pretty much stay outside at this point in time. Hang out here. That's needing iron ingots. Cool. Alright, so those are running. I hit the logs upstairs. This guy needs nine iron ingots. So that's eventually going to come out of here. I don't know where those stones... I guess I pull them out. Uh, you don't need to be here because you're in my face. And you don't need to be here. Go. Yeah, that's fine. A little too cluttery feeling to me. Right. Those are working at a pretty decent clip now, but they're all powered on the way they're supposed to be. I'm going to take this guy over here. He's basically full. Take as many out of here, see if we can get this fully emptied out. Get this guy stacked to the brim. Just like that. And then we can get you placed properly. Okay. And then get you back over here. That way you're very easy. And I have access to you from inside. So that's absolutely... I like it. I like it a lot. Let's see. I don't remember what this guy was looking for. It's just needing three iron for another turbine. So let's stack up whatever we can find. Boy, that copper is filling up quick. Is that all the everything. I plant cobalt, no lead, two iron, no more in that. And then more glass. And I guess I could start throwing glass. Where did I put glass in, in hardware? Start throwing some glass in these guys. Whoa. What do they take? Eight glass? Yeah, that's a lot of glass and steel and screws. So it looks like I am going to finally run through. Well, I hardly have any screws left at this point. 
to steal. This is probably a mistake using up all these screws. I have one steel here. Don't mind getting like just like one window up. What do we need for one more steel? Okay, so I'm gonna spend a few minutes. I'm gonna go back here and see if I can get lucky and smell down a few steel. Uh oh, my boy's tired. Probably need some fluid. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Alright, so there's the last steel that we need. I'm gonna go ahead and convert that, smelt that. Convert that. And let's see, what do we have over here? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's amazing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's amazing how much that takes. All right. Uh, well, the watermelons are upstairs now. That's a little bit of a yeah for me, but it is what it is. Let's see. We'll have a melon, corn, sure. Take my oatmeal, beautiful. Some basic potatoes for the protein count. Some mayo, rock food, I should say. Some potatoes. Onion, a little bit more, I mean, a little bit more just like that. If you're basically rocking a full hundo, 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 up and down, five points short. But that's okay. Perfect. All right, let's get all this biofuel put away. Where's fuel? Fuel, and well, we have a decent amount of fuel starting to stock up, so that's good news. This guy is needing iron. So I should have some iron coming out ever so shortly. Let's see, your quest. Looks like I'm gonna have the iron right here. Oh, actually, I have two iron right here. Is that gonna knock you out? It will not. That will not finish you off. And I will have a steel coming out so we can get that first window built. Let's see kind of what it feels like to have a window there. Because that hazy look. I mean, I get it. If. If it was a perfect looking window, then you would never finish building it if it was perfect. Ah, see? So you can go away. No, 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 not out there. Okay, and then not glass wall. Glass railing. I mean, excuse me, wooden railing can go away. Okay, those are both clearly all the way outside. Yeah. See, I like it. I like it. Alright. Uh, let's put all this whatever it is away that I have on me. Is that it? Some more glass. I did want to put some lights in here, but that could be... I'm going to throw more glass out here. Whew. That's just waiting on steel. That's waiting on steel. Okay, so it's not too too, too, too bad. Alright, let's go put this when... I like that. I like it. Alright, where are we for food and stuff up here? 537. I don't know how long it takes for those to mature. I don't want to... I mean, I guess I can uh, do a little bit of refill on this guy here. There are like the three pumpkins, I mean, excuse me, three watermelons worth in there. Did I not pick them all up? I did not, so I'll drop one. Let's pick it up now. Okay. So put it back over a thousand. That's perfect. Mike's jobs. Logs and plants. I mean, I think that's the correct correct way of doing it, but for some reason he is just not stocking his logs. And that's his number one priority. So I don't know what his issue is, why he's not chopping wood. It doesn't seem to make any sense to me. So steel, and that needs iron. Let's see, where are we on the iron thing? It's only 20, so... You run around here for a minute, see if we can get some more steel. That's not one. Uh oh, what up, dude? I saw you. See, I hit him three times, he never saw me. And all of a sudden he hit me. Oh, yeah, I'm lucky. I'm a beast. Get on coal. There we go. So for every two steel, and also, I really need to pay attention about the truck. I don't really have a place to put the truck on the garage. Yet, I have not figured out how I'm going to approach that. I, mean, I did have an idea, but I don't think it's going to work because there's one. I don't think it's going to work because I think that the garage is a lot taller than the way I think it is in my mind. I think it'll be fine. It makes it stick way higher than what I was thinking about. Like. I don't think these rock formations are spawning. Oh, there's a couple. It just feels like. Let's 
And I did notice that our little uh, buddy that was trapped on the steps, he is gone, thankfully. Boy, it does add some weight pretty quick, though, doesn't it? And they'll eventually have to stop taking sand. Yeah, the frags can go under there for now, that'll be just fine. I like being able to see out here. I like being able to see out here. And I'll and I'll and I may end up rebuilding this pretty quickly here. Because it looks a little silly to me. Mike, are you working, bud? My, my I don't feel like you're working. I don't where are you? Where are you, Mike? And what what are you doing up there, dude? Besides just eating food, because you're clearly not logging, and that is your number one priority. I don't understand if he, is he stuck? Is he not able to get out here? Something doesn't seem right with him. It does not seem right at all. Plenty of veggies and stuff. I mean, like a couple pumpkins, some cucumber, all kinds of stuff. Is this thing emptied out? It is emptied out. Okay. That butcher table needs iron. Yeah, so that's going to continue to make. This is on the way. And then we're going to stand this next guy up. And we are probably going to put him on. What are we going to put him on? That's all cobalt. So I'm going to pull this copper out and probably make more screws out of that. Just so everything that's in in the... the I don't think it's so full. Everything that's in is, supposed to, is, is, the, is the metal that matches. Okay. So let's pull these bad boys out of here. Smelt this down. It's totally fine. Let's go add you. Hopefully I had mine. I don't think I had mine. Nope. Three short. Plus we have some aluminum and some glass. No, that's the steel I needed for the next one to really get this front. Of it. Yep. So now you're probably gonna fly out on the outside, aren't you? Yep. Yep. Yeah. See, that's I've got logs hanging out there, Mike. Go get those logs for me, bud. I really like the way that looks. That's gonna be beautiful out there. What is all this? This is more glass. Don't need you glass in here. Yeah, we'll take glass of you. Okay, and then we've got a little bit of copper built up here, so we'll just, I don't know. How many is that? Maximum screws? Perfect hundred. Alright, let's see what we have to be burned through. Not as many as I thought we would, that's for sure, but we can put those back up here for now. Hardware. So this is all going to be stuck on glass. No, not even glass, really. This is all just waiting on steel. Yeah, basically steel and glass. So do I want to keep working on that stuff? I don't know if that's... What do we need here? This guy needs to be ironing, so let's pop a few more. Just one steel. Every two steels a pane of glass. That's pretty obvious you guys are all smart. Don't tell me anything you don't know. I was taking a bath, some cold cave water. That I was not able to collect yesterday for whatever reason. How is this bad? Like, I feel like there's something like, stuck in the walls or something that you just can't see. Or something. Like... I'm working over there. I wonder if I can trick the game. Like, I walk in and out a couple times. Like, I don't know if it Wacky right here. If you're gonna be here, I'm gonna get you. And you. Alright, 
let's see if Mike's doing anything productive upstairs. Nope. Well, hey, I guess he did fill a little bit, didn't he? All right, so I did want to make some railing and stuff up here. So we're going to come over here because we don't need Cap Daddy falling off over here. So we're just going to circle through. I should have left enough room on all the sides. That makes me nervous. You know, I was going to work on these railings and stuff and expand all this out, but I'm going to change my mind real quick here. I am going... Woo. I am so thankful that that is there like that. That's while that's smelting. Let's see. See, Sky has 10 HP on it. That makes me nervous. I, um, I need some iron. Do I have iron? I'm gonna put him on repair duty. It's just 30. Should have plenty of planks upstairs. Let's see how many I can grab. Before I go over inventory size. We're going to make some repair kits. Oh my goodness. Mike. Bud, come save me. Those things are too expensive. Look at them all. Holy moly. We'll see if we can. There's 25. There's still five more sitting around somewhere. Wait. Did I make 25? No, I only made 25 in total. Okay. So, I'm going to put him on repair duty. I don't know why that door is closed. So, repair stuff, and then do plants, and then do logs. So, let's see if we can get some of the stuff out front repaired. Because that makes me very nervous. Because I remember seeing that a couple times in the, some of the recent videos. Where the HP on that structure is right here. We're getting very, very low. This guy's 55. Yeah, this stuff all clearly needs to be repaired. So we cannot neglect that. Where are we here? Uh, we got some all kinds of funny stuff going on here. Let's see if we can get this guy built out. If we can. Cool. We're going to get him added over here. And put him on probably... Let him be on Cobalt. Sure. Cobalt sounds good. And then all of a sudden I'm going to not have any copper and I'm going to be upset that I have no copper. Okay, we'll take another steel. That's fine. And we'll whack this. There's two right here, so we're going to go ahead and whack these guys and see if we can get lucky if I have that last steel. Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's one more over here. This is probably going to get stuck in the wall and I won't be able to loot it. And it's an iron. Nope, it's a stone. Okay, so I don't feel so bad when it's one that I don't want, but when it's something I really want, it makes me really bummed. Some more lead. And I don't want to smelt one steel. I'm going to have to go out there and do those repairs myself. It also wouldn't be a bad idea to start doing some upgrades on those iron frags. So, let's see what we got here. Two of those bad boys. What is that? Some more steel. Nice. So then, this wooden railing can go away, this pillar can go away, and this pillar can go away because the... Do I need... St what do I need to repair these bad boys? Well, that's been repaired. Oh, thanks, Mike. That's that's good news there. Alright, let's get the stuff upstairs. And then we're going to revisit the idea of building out the railings and the decking and stuff up there, maybe. Uh, so th these pillars disappear... Because, man, you're pretty full. Uh, because they have steel in them, and the way I look at it is if it's got steel windows, then that's a strong enough support to hold that second floor up. So, those are filling up nicely. How are we doing over here? We don't want you running out. We're going to look at probably. You're going to need another battery very, 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 very soon, because we got to get some of this capacity up, because we stay at full capacity. Now that's, yeah, we'll leave that on for a minute. We're going to place another battery. Just start throwing stuff in it. I think it's electrical parts is, is the main problem. Five lead. Probably have those. One, two, three, four, five. Four copper, four aluminum. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Just like, oh, I'm overweight. 
What's got me so heavy? Okay, what do I have on me? A bunch of glass and some iron. So can we throw some more glass in some of these things? You don't need it. You'll take it. You'll take it. Sure. Okay, so there goes that. Uh, we got two more steel, so that's good. We can smelt that down. Let's, uh, do we need more? I don't think I want any more glass at this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's fine. And ten. I could throw those nails here. I've got some more iron. Where do we want to put this iron? Start working on maybe the butcher table out here. Because it only needs eight. And the spring's rolling around. What do we need here? Five electrical parts. Uh... There's another iron there. Five electrical parts. I wonder if I have... Uh, what do I have here? I've got the copper. See if there's any more cobalt. I think I just need a couple more cobalt. Cobalt, cobalt. Look at that. Four cobalt. Six cobalt. I don't... I, I'm going to take this copper just because it's in here. And you're not doing anything yet. My dude is getting very thirsty. I don't think I have clean water on me, so I'm either going to have to drink dirty water, clean wa go clean some water, or just take the HP hit, because I, I think you can do it with a chair. I think you can just get HP back with a chair. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10, and then you, you become steel like that. And these guys are smelting. It's fine, just like that. You know, I'm just gonna drink some dirty water. It's fine. So I can use one of these little med kits. That'll be just fine. That way I can stay working down here, because I really want to get these five electrical parts, and before I go upstairs, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, I'll need two more cobalt. Oh, I gotta be careful on the plastics, too, because I have not done nearly as much looting this season. Uh, that's not any of the stuff I was looking for that's over here. All right, hold on. Let me put all this back. Put all that back. What do we have on this? Just the plastics. That's fine. That's some more iron. We'll put this on the butcher table out here. See if that comes up. Oh, we're one short. What about you? Ah, yes. I'm liking it. We're getting there. Like it. Really wish you'd pick that stuff up for me. I know you're not going to. Let's see. Boom. There's a perfect spot for it right there. Nice. What do we need? Just steel. We're really steel. And then this is some electrical parts that I'm just kind of waiting on. Uh, I can turn this off. Electrical parts that we're waiting on. I can smelt a couple more little itty bitty things like this. Do I have any room for any more glass? Yeah, glass can go in there. Like this. Did not mean to do that. And this. So I need a total of five electrical parts. And we'll go upstairs and convert those. And that'll give us another battery. And that will be helpful. Nope, no, 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 no. Gotta go to the advanced workbench. That'll make it where we have a little bit more power. Don't do that. And then we'll see if we can, eventually we can see if we can make it through the night and run the oil pump. Because if we can get this thing fully charged, one more of these things fully charged. What am I short? Oh! Did I not, do I not know how to count? Apparently I don't know how to count. Did I really, or did, wait, that doesn't make any sense to me because I had five plastics on me. I cert, did I drop one on the floor up there? That wouldn't make any sense. How, how would it drop on the floor? Uh-oh. Wait, one room, one room, one room. No, 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 no. Oh, it did drop on the floor. How did that happen? Okay. I'm thankful that we did that repair because I was certainly way out of position for these guys. Only two? Watch it have electrical parts. It's interesting that that piece dropped on the floor. Oh, I got my plastics. And another ore. It's interesting that it dropped on the floor like that. Because, there we go. Okay. So now let's go put this bad boy upstairs. And I'd really like to get the glass, enough glass knocked out where you can kind of, uh, yeah, stack. Okay, let's go take a look at the power. 
see if we can get some more steel. And then let's see, our total power should be about 3,000 now. 3,000, we are charging. So I'm not working on anything, so I'm going to place another wind turbine. And really, I will slow down on the wind turbines kind of once I get to the point where five lead, four iron, aluminum. I will probably slow down on the wind turbines once I have enough wind turbine power to run the oil pump all night long without using any battery at all. Lead, what do we need on this bad boy? Four, three more cobalt, which are just sitting right here. Luckily, that's that. Uh, five lead and four iron. Don't have any of that or any of it. So let's see if we can find some more. Got a little bit here. One, two, three, four, five iron coming right up. Let's go pop another lead or two out of here. This should be enough to accomplish two steel. And smelt down what it is that we needed. Just a like a dead. Just a like a dead. Is this guy done yet? Nope. Now the picture table's up. That makes me happy. This guy is good, so let's drop this. Yeah, let's definitely drop on those on the outside. Um, where are we on this guy? One more steel ingot on this guy, and then we'll almost have the entire front face glassed out like that. And that just looks really cool to me. Is this steel? It's aluminum. That's steel. So that will eventually this needs to be refilled. Don't run out. Can't have you running out. Swap you out. Uh, we'll swap you out with this guy. Looks like you're nice and full. And I don't know if the grinder is faster or just automated. Like, I don't know if the efficiency is better to use like one stone per frag or if it's better to use the grinder and you get more or if it's exactly the same you know what i mean i don't know if i'm explaining myself very well but got some extra iron sitting on me this is empty this is empty i mean basically empty right this guy is starting to fill up good okay so i've got some extra iron on me these guys are smelting down what do we have been going on here another cobalt another cobalt Three cobalt, copper, a copper, you a cobalt, you are a cobalt. <laughs> uh, I've gotten a little aggressive on the cobalts, but I knew I was going to do that. We're going to place another extractor, and we might turn this corner a little bit here, and eventually, here right now, big O whiff. I'll take you, just to take you. Oop. Just to see if that'll make the RNG gods happy. All right, where are we here? We've got, holy moly, a bunch of lead. Did you need lead? I think that's probably why I smelted that much lead. Get in there. Yeah, we're just waiting on four iron ingots. Oh yeah, there's another one. And another one. Like I said, well, I think I'll have to do something creative to get these gla this glass set on this wall back here. Oof. Because I don't think it likes the steps. Inter Cause see how it intersects? This looks like a well, maybe not. I might be able to get away with it. Let's take a look. What can we get? No. 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 It does not like it with the steps. So maybe after we build this one, maybe Ooh, it'll let me snap to it. So let's see where we are as far as. I don't know what you are. Another steel. All right. Can get all you going here. And lead can go in here. Is this going to have some more iron? This will have all. This will have some more iron. That'll finish off another wind turbine. We're going to throw some coal up here. We're going to throw the plastic and the big stuff. We're gonna, uh, we need hardware. We need some more. We need some more screws. Sure, just go like that. Did I have any more glass, or did I burn it all? I think I burned it all, and I just deleted all of the sand. So that was not the best decision of my life. 
What was I doing? This guy here. Yep. That was not the best decision of my life to burn off all of that. There's one more steel. Okay, stay away from me. You just stay right there. Let's see you stay where you are. Stay right up. We won't mess with each other. Okay? That way, you get to survive. Man, that is three for three. That right there is good, good stuff. No, nothing else. Are we done in here? Looks like it. Let's, oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's see. Look, there's stuff in here. One night popped out. How about you? No? I mean, at least I had access to them, right? At least they weren't. Okay, well, let's go convert a couple more steel. And now that the night's falling on us, we need to be real careful as our power usage here is going to be really high. Uh, oh, I'm going to try the grinder off for now. We're going to see if we can try to stay somewhat in the green. Let me Some more steel. Some more glass, some more iron, some more, some more, and some more. I don't remember what you're waiting on, bud. Iron. Didn't I just say I needed iron? And do I have iron on me? I have iron on me. Why didn't they go in there? All right, where are we here now? Negative 17. We are really close to running just off of wind turbines all night long for the oil pump. Having that at zero, a, a net of zero, is will be a big accomplishment. You need to go up high here. Let's go up high here, and you face that way, and you get all those nice winds from that direction. It'd be a big accomplishment to know that those extractors can run all night long without tripping over to the alternate fuel source. So I know I'm going to need some more lead, so I'm going to grab a couple extra lead. Fine. I think I still have some in there. I don't want to over farm it because I'm going to place another wind turbine and see if we can get to zero. Aluminum. Oh, I have a ton of aluminum in there though. Lead. I could smelt some lead. Do I have any lead? Wait, one, two, four cobalt should have sitting here. There we go. We've got the cobalt sitting here. So we need a couple more lead and some aluminum and some iron. Some iron, lead, and aluminum. What is all this? Steel. Uh, you can go there. Short glass. Interesting. Short glass. Okay. Well, and I have no more sand coming out of here, right? Because this thing's powered off through the night. So do I have a workbench down here? I don't want to run all the way up there. Okay, let's get focused up and do one thing at a time. Let's get you. I need aluminum and lead. So I've got, should have plenty of aluminum out here to just grab. That's probably going to put me overweight. Yep. And we'll smelt just like that. And then we will convert you just like that. And then you guys can go in here. And then we'll come empty you out. You're good, you're good. Ooh, man, that's really full. It's okay. Ooh, lead. We're going to take that lead. And we're going to throw you in here. And we're just going to... Yep, and that's okay for now. We're at negative six. So that's not bad. And that's... And that's I guess the wind's slowly picking up. So this guy is just waiting on nine aluminum, which is getting ready to pop out of this forge. And then three lead, which looks like it's going to pop out of this forge. So that's good. What do we need over here on this guy? This guy needs some glass. This guy needs everything. And this guy needs some glass. So let's... I mean, I guess I could make some more glass, right? I, I mean, I don't want to burn the stones, but these guys are going to run all night long. 
anyways and, and keep collecting and the grinder is not running, then I guess it's kind of like no harm, no foul. It's 11.21 on day 13. So we've only got about 30 minutes left on this day. So we're just going to grab a nice big old st chunk of this. Doesn't matter. We'll just take as many as we can hold. Because it's a two for one deal. Just like that. I just got to be careful on the weight. Because there will be no dropping it off, I don't think. Anywhere. 43. I should be able to get all this converted out. Oh, there's only two left. Yeah. So 45. And that should get us a decent amount of glass on that front panel. See if we can get these guys knocked out. Get this building sealed back up again. Uh, I've got to be. I have no inventory space, so let's drop. I don't know something like this just for now. A bunch of rando stuff in here. Need three more aluminum, which I have a ton of that coming out of here. This should be another one. Nice. Let's see. Throw as much aluminum. We're going to spam. Get it all out like that. Get it all out like that. Looks fine to me. And then we're going to do some more glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Another couple panels with glass again. We definitely have a lot of sand sitting around. We've got some more aluminum sitting around. So now let's take a look at our power situation. We are at positive 12. I don't remember what the absolute minimum is. As far as what the panels can produce. Like the, uh, not panels, sorry. The wind turbines will produce. But I do know that it's 1158 on day number 13. And we are at the point where we're going to call this the night. So thank you so much for hanging out with me this evening, this day. I hope this episode's been a little bit more enjoyable over day 12 because that was pretty rough. So we'll see you guys tomorrow for day number 14. Uh-oh, there's an attack coming. Do you hear it? All right, hope you guys join me tomorrow. We'll see ya. All right, guys, it's day 14. And I was not going to continue on today, but with that music creeping in like that, makes me want to make sure we defend our house. This is our house. So I know they're coming. I did set the attacks to a pretty high value. I think it's like a maximum of 12. I forgot to mention that I went pretty bonkers uh, because the, the onesie and twosie guys don't really do much. So hopefully this attack will occur sooner rather than later. Do I, do I have enough to run let's run the grinder for a little bit because I can turn it off and go positive again okay 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 I, why can't I do anything I'm stuck I have no hold on please I can't do anything hold please I can't do anything my menus are stuck guys 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 I can't do anything guys this is a uh oh I'm I, uh oh I'm I'm I am screwed guys I have no control over my game